We got a lot for you, but wait, wait, there is more, because I am so excited to have this amazing comedian with us. It's Jenna Kim Jones is here, who is performing at the Chandler Art Center. Come on in, come on in here. Woo! There she is. Oh my hi. goodness, hi. hi. Come on in. This is awesome. Now slide over. Get I'm in coming here. in here. I'm coming to sit next to Brad. This yes. is an honor. This oh is, my goodness. You know, this is like on Johnny Carson's Ooh. show when yeah. they have you come sit on the couch. That means you're going to make it. I, so you are going to look it. You heard it here. You are. Jenna, how are you? So good. This is awesome. So good, yeah. You know, we here at the Arizona Daily Mix love supporting comedians. My daughter's one. I love it. You're in town, um, and you are actually taping your special here in Arizona at Chandler uh, Center for the Arts. Yeah, I chose Arizona. I, I know the people here are special. <laughs> They're wonderful. They like to laugh. So come out to my show tomorrow night. That's I love it. Right. And what's really great is that you are a clean comedian. I am. And, and there's yeah. nothing wrong with the other comedians there, but <laughs> you've been seeing the need. We've been seeing the need for it. And that's why this special is so important. It is. To, to, to film. Yes. I get called often. I'll finish a show and people are like, you're kind of like a female Jim Gaffigan. Ooh. So yeah, that's... I mean, That's not bad. Really, he's a big role model for me in yeah, comedy. But you're prettier. But Oh, thank you. Yeah, very thank prettier you. than Jim. Thank you. Um, so I have been called that, but there are not a lot of us female clean comics. Yeah. So uh, you should definitely check out my show. It's... It's funny. It's really funny. It and, and the reason why I love funny is that you also have this podcast that mm. you do with someone, I don't know, yeah. what you guys do together, but yeah, it's my just... Husband. <laughs> yeah, my husband. Yeah, it's yeah. a couple podcasts. He's so. here with me. Um, I Actually, it's kind of shaky right now, though, i got to be honest, Ooh. because we got in last night, and we were at the car rental place, and the only car they had was a Tesla. Yeah, oh. and uh, I think he might leave me for her. Oh, what? Yes. <laughs> I'm not sure he's going to even come back and pick me up. No, okay? he's not. <laughs> that is so funny. And that's what you talk about on your show. You talk yeah. about your, yeah. your relationship. And, and then yeah. the stand-up is so cool, um, and we love it. Um, let's do a little background on you, because um, you get to brag a little bit that you were in the business. Yes. Um, and then all of a sudden you said, you know what? I'm going to uh, pretty much go do stand-up. And you were, you were working <laughs> for The Daily Show. I was. Years ago, I Anybody out of college, I do that? worked at The Daily Show with Jon Stewart. Right. So um, and I loved it. It was such a great experience. I learned so much about writing. That's where I started doing stand-up. And I actually hosted like a monthly show with all of the amazing guys that's at Daily Show who oh would come do stand-up. And I would just be there little opener trying to figure out what I was doing on stage and not sure how I got there um, and then after a few years of that I actually met my husband and we decided we were just gonna kind of blow up our lives and I was like okay great and we moved to California and I've been doing stand-up full-time ever since. I love it this is yeah. awesome so yeah um, okay so the show is two shows tomorrow yep. taping both of them yes. because that's what happens yes. in a special if you've never seen a special shot you got to go to it because it's really cool to see yeah. how it all works but also then you're part of it right uh, when it hits TV yeah. And so we don't know where it's going yet. Not yet. But I'm but putting stay the filler tuned. out there. I'm gonna go. I, can I do it? I'm gonna say it because listen, I, I listen. I knew the black eyed peas yeah. before they were the Cross black eyed peas. They, they were actually pinto language. beans. Like they All right. And so when I said, hey, you know, this like, lady Fergie, hey, and you guys are gonna go somewhere. Yeah. Bam! Then okay. they became the Black Eyed Peas. You heard it here. So I'm gonna say Netflix. I'm the Netflix. next <laughs> comedian Fergie. I'm the, the next the, Fergie com of comedy. There it is, there it right is. there. Yeah. And you're gonna be on Netflix. Can we say that? Let's tell people. Sure. So there you go. Why you wanna not? go? You wanna go check the show? Why not? Um, <laughs> there you go. I'm telling. I know I'm gonna get in trouble. Say, don't say anything. We don't don't. But That's you fine. are. You're doing it. So and I want that to go on social media. Everything. All right. What I love to do is, um, since you have worked on the Daily Show, yeah. Um, can you do some topics with me? I'd love to. So I'd love to get your take on them. Well, so, all right. All right. Because the first one is kind of upsetting me because I got to know who's going to pay the agent now, the avatar or the model who actually they're doing the avatar off of because this is called Phonogenics and it's a Los Angeles based art driven model agency that is now having an avatar division. So they're not people. They're not people. They're they're the models, I guess, but they're 3D avatars versions of 13 models. Okay. There they are. I'm looking at them right now. Right. Okay. And so there they go. And so now this is where they can actually not to have the models show up to do the, uh, the yeah, different well, stuff. Yeah, well, I do know one thing. This is definitely going to help the uh, expectations of women and realistic expectations <laughs> of how <laughs> women should look. I do know that that's going to be that, helpful right there. Yeah, yeah look at those cheekbones. Wow, They're perfect. Yeah, and the eyes yeah. and everything like that. But 
I mean, who gets paid now? Does the Avatar have to pay, or does, it, or does the, the does the Avatar, the Avatar pay the fake money? Just so rich. Just, like, well, they, where's they, all the money? The robots have it. Yeah, they that's do. it. They yeah. have all the money now. So yeah. that's gonna be a lot of money right there. So interesting. Interesting. Okay, this is it. I love bears. Do you love bears? Why not? Do, why not? Why <laughs> not? Just like why not? Okay, let me let's take on this one. This one's pretty what funny. What kind of bears? Well, real bears. Yeah, real bears. Okay. Because like lately the bears have been in the news, but check out this shop. Looking bear. <gasps> he just walks in, grabs some food, and look. Oh, see, he's just hungry. Wait, so this is like, is this like a new Snickers commercial? Did, like I, he picked up a Snickers he and thinks, he's like, he like so. wasn't that their campaign? If you're hungry, eat a Snickers. If you're a bear, just yeah. <laughs> it, oh, there he walks go. out, and now he's all nice. He's like again. nice and yeah, yeah. yeah. But, um, is this in Atlanta? Because there have been bear sightings in Atlanta is lately. It? So yeah. that's well, I don't know, but that's the thing that gets me. It's like, where do you live where the bear just kind of like strolls in? And the problem is, like, how do you get in the door? Do you just kind of like, ding, come in? I like, don't know. Yeah. But I love, I love that these bears are doing. We had one yesterday that had a how, birthday party. How did he get in the door? Right. I'm, that's what I'm trying to figure out too. Like, who let that bear in? Someone just said, "Come on in, bear." <laughs> like, there you go. And do you stop the bear? Do you go, "Hey, put that back"? It looks like. I mean, he's got good tasting. Yeah, he's gra he grabbed a lot and just yeah. walked out there. Yeah. Crazy. All right, my last one here. I love this okay. one because this bear actually has manners. So, oh. uh, yeah, listen to this. Close the door, sweetie. No, 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 hon. The door. Close the door. Close the door. Good boy. Well, we know how the bear got in the other place. <laughs> yeah, we, the, the door. So this is a bear, and it's, and it's uh, a, a bear oh, opens the door and then politely boy. closes it to after wiping its feet. That is, is that a good bear or what? Wipes his feet, and, and then, like, oh, wait, it comes oh, oh, back. He's peeking he's back like, in. What, but wait, what? what? Get out. Get out. Okay. Bye, honey. Oh, my god. I'm going goodness. to work. Well, but, and who's the calm woman? Like, Bear, just leave Bear. Right? Is that? No, I'm a man. I'd be like, uh-uh. I'd be like, scream. Ah, get out! Get out! I'd be throwing things. I'd be, it'd be scary. So, <laughs> Russian. So, no. She's English. She was talking. She's like, yeah, get out there. Good hey, boy. Jenna, yes. I'm so glad you stopped by. Thank you so much I know you're very busy and everything. Me. Please tell everybody again, uh, two shows tomorrow. Yes, two shows tomorrow night. Chandler Center for the Arts, 5.30 and 8.30. And if you want a discount, use the coupon code Jenna50 at uh, Ticketmaster.com for a discount. There you go. And please follow her on Instagram yes. and all social media at Jenna Kim Jones. That's right. She's very funny. This is the new star. You, you see it right here. <laughs> um, I'm, I'm actually gonna, I might go there to be a part of the uh, special. Or can I, I just film something? Yeah. 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 So, Come like on it. out. All right. Yeah. All right. I'm gonna chat a little more with Jenna while you all chat amongst yourself at home and get ready to come back.